Hey guys, it's Matt here, and uh, welcome back to another Matt movie right here on my Matt's Movies channel. I uh, hope you all had a good day, and uh, today we will be looking at another one of my Phantom Zone projectors that I created out of my collection, and I'm actually joined with LEGO Channel 62. They're actually and just right here. They're, um, they'll are they appear in the crossover video later, because we're going to make one. Um, but they're making more Phantom Zone protectors, so, yeah, yeah. anyway, so today, so, it's, so if you don't know, so I'm going to create an entire series, which will essentially show all my different Phantom Zone projectors, and then once we reach the last one, um, then that will be, like, the grand finale. Now, we're not going to make a lot, we'll probably just make a couple others, and then that's it, so, but yeah, just a couple others, and that will be it, but, so we got a long ways to go, but, anyways, we're going to continue on with, uh, Mark number two of the uh, Phantom Zone projectors. So let's begin now. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the uh, last one I made. Um, so, anyways, let's continue or let's begin. Sorry. Um, so as you can see right here, we got a uh, Lego stud plate right here, which I made yellow to kind of, so kind of like a yellow beam that comes out when you banish your enemies to the Phantom Zone. And then I got the um, um, the magnifying glass thing on the top. It's kind of like a it's not, it doesn't look anything like it, but I just thought it's, um, I don't know, <laughs> I just thought it would look kind of cool. And then I've got this piece, which is attached to that one. I, tr I tried to make this, like, predominantly blue and kind of, like, silverish. Now, the crystal on the bottom is green. I, um, now, as we can see right here, I got a, uh, I got one of these little, uh, rip type. I got this one, which is blue, and then this one, which is silver. The silver one is actually attached to this piece, which is a handle. And then, as we can see right here, here's the operating system, which is a bunch of buttons that you, like, boop, beep, beep, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> that kind of reminds me of, um, the, the Lego Batman movie story pack from Lego Dimensions, which, where Batman's like, boop, beep, beep, boop, 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 boop. And, anyway, so, and I attached this piece to here because, um, I don't know, it just thought it looked cool. And I got this little, kind of, like, striped-like pattern there. So... Um, yeah, and it, and the next little magnifying glass, the scope, is attached to this piece, which I attached to here, and then this piece was attached there, and, and then I also attached this little, uh, light gray piece with the stud at the end, so that way I could hold that in place, so it all kind of, like, works together, as you can see, um, it's kind of more fat-like, no, it's, it's more fat than the other one, but, uh, that's okay, it's a prototype anyway, so... Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it for this video. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. That would be appreciated. And, um, and definitely check out LEGO Channel 62, because they make some pretty yeah. cool videos. And, um, we're gonna... a lot of news updates and, uh, mock builds and reviews and stuff. Yeah, so, yeah. so yeah. they're gonna be making some, uh, we're, we're gonna be doing a crossover video together later on, so stay tuned for yeah. that. But, um, for right now, thank you for watching, and we'll see you later, and, uh, peace out.